Hey guys, what's up? This is Angel Writer Speaks. I wanted to take time, make of this video, and to say thank you to a couple people, but also to say I'm sorry in my own way. The thank you comes to my friends Cream, Fema, as well as Squeaky, who hosted a show uh, this past Saturday night. And we got into some not only awesome conversations, but I had a lot of food for thought that I came from out of it. Not only did it inspire me to make this video, but it has inspired me to what I want to do with my show next time I come around. And speaking of that, this past Thursday I had a show that was hoping going to be a tribute show and unfortunately didn't come out that way. It got really out of focus, and frank, quite frankly, lately in my room, things have gotten out of control. That confused quite a few people, so to those of you who were confused, I apologize for that. I know that some people were offended and claimed that I was gaining popularity from the whole Rise is Death thing. Now that was never my intention at all. My intention was to get my group of friends who also knew Rise to celebrate life, to really appreciate each other, and in our little way show that, hey, maybe Rise is gone, but we still have each other. But like I said, things didn't work out that way. And yeah, I think a few people were hurt. Cream explained it to me best during Squeak's show, and that really made me think. And then I right away sent a PM to his girlfriend, Fema, and said, Yeah, I gotta apologize if it got you mad or offended or whatever. The great thing is, is because they're on my online friends, you know, they, they were cool about it. They said, Hey, it's over, it's done with, move on. And even if it's over and done with the move on, sometimes it's good to say you're sorry, even if you don't mean it. And I can really understand where they're coming from, because they knew Rise better than I did. And of course, their feelings are a lot deeper. And I totally understand that. When you lose somebody that's a good friend or a loved one, or they're about in between, it really does hurt. It it hits you. It hits you like a knife. In my real life, I'm kind of going through that now with the expected loss of a friend much, much older, but somebody that became a part of my life through the gaming group I'm in. In fact, he was the creator of the game that I play on Friday nights when ever I go over there or whenever there's a game to be played in which I'm in the process of writing an adventure for it at the moment. And to know when somebody has a short time left or know that they can go at any second, it's rough. I've been through it with his wife who died about six months ago and now I'm doing it with him. With Rise it was a little bit different though. It was suddenly and none of us expected it. It just sort of happened out of the blue. And I think that's why it kind of stings a little bit and hurts the most. So, like I said, if I've offended anybody during my blog TV show, if people were just hurt or whatever, you know, I, I'm a, I'm sorry. I apologize. I didn't intend to do the whole gain the popularity thing because that's in in general that's not my way. And I think those people who have yet to know me or don't know me, I don't think realize that. On the flip side to that as well, knowing what I've known, hearing what I've heard. I need to refocus things. I may need to take a break from Block TV for a while. I don't know. Because, frankly, things have gotten a little out of control there. I've already had to ban a couple people that have caused some chaos, and... I will say, from going to Sweet Geek's show, I think 
I have probably been inspired to do something a little bit different next time around. So thank you guys for watching. I would ask you to keep Rise's family and friends in your thoughts and prayers, as well as for me. We could all use a little prayer. We could all use some blessings or whatever you believe in. I think this is a time to gather our first, second, third families together, tell them we appreciate them, and most definitely support one another. Thanks, guys.